Hello, we're live. Welcome to Steve's Wacky Webcam World. Um, right, video update. Day one. Set off from Land's End today. Well, set, set off from St. Just, actually. Um, we rode from St. Just to Land's End, so six miles before we'd even started going in the wrong direction. That was a bit of a laugh. I uh, wasn't planning on that, but hey, ho, that's the way they did it. So um, that's a nice little treat for us. Um, then, yeah, got to Land's End about nine. Did all the obligatory photos by the um, signpost thingy. Got some nice photos. Uh, I'll try and post them when I get a mo. Uh, otherwise, it'll be after the whole trip. But I'll uh, I'll put them on the right day. Um, yeah, weather was a bit crap, but um, nothing too nothing too problematic. It, 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 it's been grey and drizzly all day. Uh, it really started coming down just before lunch, but. Um, so it was, yeah, I was getting a bit cold by the time we pulled up for lunch, but uh, it was fine after that. Um, took it very easy this morning on purpose. Didn't want to get too carried away coming out the traps and um, kill myself on the first morning of the whole trip. Um, so purposely took it very steady. Uh, went along with a couple of guys that were going nice and slow. Um, probably a little bit too slow actually, but. Um, but no problem and um, yeah so this morning was fine uh, and then nice little pub lunch um, and we had a little ferry trip after that a little chain link ferry across a um, river somewhere you're cycling all day you don't know where the hell you are half the time especially with all these crazy Cornish names um, but that is cool bit of a novelty going across that on the um, uh, with the bikes uh, and then a few more hills, a few steeper hills in the afternoon, so it got a little bit tougher. Um, and I pushed on um, up the pace a little bit as well. Uh, it's nice that I'm doing this by myself actually, because you, ju you just drift along at your own pace and um, meet other people on the trip and sort of hang about with them for a while and then crack on, go a bit faster if you want to, or drop back if they're, they're pushing it a bit for you. So. Um, that's, that's good. I've seen a few other people doing it sort of in pairs and obviously that can get a bit tricky if one's wanting to go faster than the other but I'm just doing my own thing and um, meeting people as and when I do and it's that's nice. Um, so yeah, that was about it. Um, about 70 miles or just over 70 miles today which is um, a little bit further than advertised and with the with the six miles before the start as well, um, it meant I was um, yeah I was I was ready to stop. I wasn't dead on my feet, but I was, I was ready to stop when we got into Foy. Um, hopefully, yeah. But left plenty in the tank for tomorrow, I think. Hopefully, because tomorrow's going to be a hard day. I think it's it's the hardest day of the whole trip on paper. So um, that will be fun. Um, especially for poor old Pete, guy who's really struggling at the moment. He had a couple of um, can I do this? What have I signed up for? Moments today, I think. But um, yeah, and there's and there's more to come. So hopefully he'll find his legs and get into it. Otherwise, he's going to have an unpleasant time. Um, but he's a nice lad. Hopefully, um, hopefully he'll be okay. Everyone else seems quite cool. Um, quite an older crowd. Quite a few retired guys and um, people like that doing it. But a few youngsters as well. Still getting to know everyone. But it's all good. Most people headed for the same pub in Troy tonight. The Galleon had a massive plate of um, uh, was it chicken curry, which will hopefully sort me out, give me a bit of energy for tomorrow. Um, that's the one good thing about these. You can you can eat loads in safe in the knowledge that you're burning most of it off. Um, that's about it for today, I think. Um, as I say, body held up fine. I was good, but it was on fresh legs, so um, I'm not getting too cocky just yet. Um, bike was fine. Didn't miss a beat. No punches or anything. I know one other guy had a puncher, but uh, uh, I've been fine so far. Touch wood. Um, and that is about it. Probably going to get my head down in a minute, get some kip, because uh, as you all know, I like my kip anyway. And it's tiring days, and it's an early start each morning. So that's about it. Um, oh, roadkill. Uh, what do we have today? So a, a bunny, um, a pigeon, uh, a couple of crows, and a few frogs. I think um, I'll keep you posted on all the, all the dead wildlife that I see. But I think that is about it for today. Um, and that's about it. Hopefully the weather will pick up a bit. But 
like I said earlier, it's Cornwall. I, I, I asked the girl this morning. Actually, it was it was cloudy and misty when um when we're leaving the B and B, and I asked her if it was what the weather was going to do, and she just looked at me and said, uh, "It's Cornwall. It could be gloriously sunny in ten minutes, or it could stay like this for a fortnight." So um <laughs> I like that, but uh, yeah. So uh, I'm not counting any favours from the weather. But so far so good. Fun day and um, I'm not falling apart or thinking, oh shit, what have I signed up for just yet. So um, that's it. I'll stop rambling and um, catch you guys soon. Day two tomorrow. A nasty one. I'll probably be a broken man if I do a video tomorrow. Bye.